Did you know that 75% of tech hiring managers say a strong portfolio can make or break your chances of landing a job? Crazy, right? So what's in your portfolio? If you're thinking, hmm, maybe not enough, don't worry, we've got you covered. In this video, we will share the top 10 Java projects you can build right now to sharpen your skills and impress those hiring managers. Imagine walking into an interview and showing them exactly what you're capable of. These projects are practical, impressive, and best of all, fun to build. Plus, we have saved the most impactful one for the end. It's the kind of project that makes recruiters amazed. So stick around and let's get started. All right, starting at number 10, we have the chat application. This is a classic project and trust me, it's perfect for understanding real-time communication in Java. To build this, you'll need Java sockets for enabling real-time communication between clients and a server, and multi-threading to make sure multiple users can chat at the same time without any issues. For the user interface, you can go with Java FX or Swing, both works great. What's exciting about this project is that you'll get to work on features like real-time messaging, online and offline status indicators, and even creating private or group chats. It's like building your own mini WhatsApp. Next up, at number nine, we have the online banking system. Now, this project is super valuable because you'll dive into backend development, secure transactions, and even database management. Here's what you'll need. Spring Framework to set up the app's architecture, Hibernate for seamless database integration, and MySQL or PostgreSQL as the database to handle user accounts and transactions. For the interface, you can go with JavaFX or even JSP slash HTML if you're making a web-based system. The features? Oh, it's got everything. Registration, secure login, balance inquiries, fund transfers, and even transaction history. This one's perfect if you're curious about cybersecurity or back-end development. All right, number eight is the e-healthcare management system. If you've ever thought about creating something meaningful, this project is all about managing patient data appointments, and medical records. You'll need Spring Boot to create APIs for the backend, Hibernate for managing the database, and if you're into web apps, tools like Angular or React for a smooth front end. Of course, you'll need a database like MySQL to store all those health records securely. Some cool features include patient registration, doctor availability tracking, appointment scheduling, and even handling electronic health records. It's like bringing technology into the healthcare world. Coming in at number seven, we've got the Supply Chain Management System. This project is a gem if you're curious about how big companies manage their inventories and orders. You'll be working with Spring MVC for structuring the application, Hibernate for database interaction, and a database like PostSQL for handling all the data. Add JSP or Thymaleaf to design a user-friendly interface. You'll get to build things like inventory tracking, supplier and customer management, and even real-time analytics. It's a great way to learn enterprise-level development. All right, number six is the Smart City Project. This one's super interesting because it combines tech and urban problem solving. To pull this off, you'll need IoT integration tools like MQTT for connecting devices, Spring Boot for building the backend, and no SQL databases like MongoDB for handling all the unstructured data from sensors. Bonus, use data visualization tools like Tableau or D3GL to create dashboards. The possibilities are endless. Smart traffic management, energy conservation, waste management solutions. You'll be tackling real world issues head on. Now, at number five, we have the Virtual Private Network or VPN. This is for all you security enthusiasts out there. You'll need Java networking with SSL slash TLS protocols to encrypt data and ensure secure communication. For the heavy lifting in encryption, the Bouncy Castle library is your go-to. And of course, Java FX for building a simple user interface. The best part? You'll be implementing features like secure tunneling, encrypted data transmission, and IP masking. Imagine building something that keeps data safe over public networks. Before we move on, here's a quick tip. Always break down complex projects into smaller tasks. You can also check out our blog on top 20 plus Java projects for beginners for future references. The link is in the description. It makes managing your time and tracking your progress so much easier. 
getting back to our list. All right, number four is the facial recognition system. Now this one is as futuristic as it gets. You'll need OpenCV or its Java wrapper, Java CV, to handle image processing, and libraries like TensorFlow or DL4J for the actual face recognition part. For the UI, Java FX is perfect. This project lets you implement features like face detection, real-time recognition, and access control. It's a perfect mix of AI and software development. At number three, we have the speech recognition system. This project is all about converting spoken words into text. How cool is that? To make it happen, you'll need Java Speech API for recognizing speech and natural language processing libraries for interpreting commands. Throw in Java FX for a sleek interface and you're set. Think speech to text, command recognition, and even multilingual support. It's perfect for exploring voice controlled tech. Number two is the airline reservation system. This one's a real world challenge that's super rewarding. You'll work with Spring Boot for the back end, Hibernate for ORM, and MySQL for storing flight and user data. The interface? Use JavaFX to make it visually appealing. Key features include flight search and booking, seat selection, ticket generation, and even real-time updates for cancellations or delays. It's like building your own airline booking system. Before we reveal the top project, here's a quick tip. Always document your code as you go. It'll save you time in the long run and make your projects easier to maintain and update. And finally, at number one, we have machine learning integration. This is the ultimate challenge for 2025. You'll need tools like Weka or DL4J for working with machine learning algorithms, Apache POI for handling datasets, and JavaFX for visualizing predictions and insights. The features are next-level predictive analytics, model training, testing, and interactive dashboards. It's tough, but if you're up for the challenge, the rewards are massive. That wraps up our countdown of the top 10 Java projects. Which one are you most excited to try? Let us know in the comments below and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the Knowledge Academy for more tech content. Till then, keep learning, keep growing, see you in the next video, 